What kicks you wearing today? Ah, uh, yeah, he's barefoot. What are you gonna wear? Bare feet. You're not gonna put any shoes on? Nah, Crocs get slippery when it's sweaty. We're supposed to be promoting Crocs, uh -huh. idiot. Anybody that's out there that works for Crocs, please send us some. Camo, especially. Have a great day. Welcome back, everybody, to another video. Sorry for the delay. Uh, it's been, what, two weeks since we've made a post on this channel? I've been busy. I just came back from the Face Off Factory overnight camp. Super awesome event. Highly recommend you go. Hunter, what have you been up to for these past two weeks? Oh, I don't even know what I've been up to. All right, obviously, as you can tell by the title, we're doing another GoPro video. This week's matchup, Hunter, what do you have in your hand? The burn. Burn what? F-O. And I have... The Weapon X. This video has probably been the most requested out of every head so far. These two going against each other. A few things we gotta say before we actually get into the live reps. This is my Weapon X. This is what mine looks like. Mine's super broken in. A lot of guys that have the Weapon X complain that their head will never get to this point. Listen, it took me three months, three straight months of facing off with this thing to get it to look just like this. In Florida heat, it softens up over time. You just have to give it more time than your typical face off head to break in. So just as a reminder, mine's broken in. So when we go against each other, yours might not react the same way as ours does, right? Like, what did you say that? Okay, why am I asking you? Why the f am I asking you? Another thing worth mentioning, well, I would assume a lot of you guys know this already. Both of us are CEO guys. So we love the CEO, we love the flex. Hunter, do you like the CEO? Yes. The Weapon X does not flex anything like the CEO. It's more of a traditional styled flex. It does get a dual two flex once it starts breaking in, but it's not a CEO flex at all in any way, shape, or form. Burn FO, we might end up liking this one more because it's closer to the CEO than the Weapon X. So as sort of a pre-judging of how this is gonna go, Hunter, how do you feel these heads are gonna do against each other? Um, what do you feel more confident with? Burn FO. Why? Just like a CEO. Okay, have you used the Weapon X before? Nope. You've never used the Weapon X? No. I've had this thing for months, and you've never tried it at all? Haven't touched it. I feel like you have. Have not. Well, that's interesting. I think he's lying through his teeth. I think he has tried it. Hunter's going with the Burn FO. I might be able to sneak a few wins out with the Weapon X, but we'll see. We'll see how it goes. You excited? No. Okay. All right. Let's get right into it.
Alrighty folks, we just got done doing our live session with the Weapon X and the Burn FO. So let's start out by asking this. Hunter, you've used the Burn FO for a few times now. So you have more experience with that head than this, because you've barely used this. I think you still have. You said you haven't, but I think you definitely have before. What did you feel about the Weapon X? Anything you noticed? Anything that stood out to you? Uh, the Weapon X was a good head. Just felt like it couldn't slip under the Burn FO. It was more of a, a push rather than a slip under. You say a push because it feels like a stiffer head. It doesn't really want to come down. It would rather meet you halfway and then pry your plastic off. Biggest thing to note here between these two heads is the fact that the Burn FO feels much more flexible. It's a closer feel to the CEO, obviously, but we have to let people know that. And the Burn FO, in our opinion, well, you can speak for yourself, but in my opinion, it felt like it slipped under this much easier, even if I didn't have all the clamp. If you spent too much time on the ball with this, you gave me time to slip under with the Burn FO. But if you had it right away and you just ripped it right out, see you later. Yeah. Do you agree? I agree. Okay. So to summarize what happened in this video, unbiasedly, is that even a word? In an unbiased manner, that sounds a lot better. The Burn FO did better of slipping under. The Weapon X did better of prying off. Would you agree? I would agree. Anything else you saw between these two heads? Mm -mm. Nope. All right, that's gonna wrap up this video. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Let us know down in the comment section which faux GoPro video you wanna see next, which two heads you wanna see stacked up. Well, I think we have a pretty good idea of what we wanna see next. This was easily, by far, the most, or the highly requested, most most requested video was the Weapon X and the Burn FO because people didn't know what they're going to do against each other, how they felt, whatever. Hopefully this helps with your decision making process if you're trying to get a new head and you can't decide between the Burn FO or the Weapon X. Short answer, if you like the CEO, Burn FO. If you don't like the CEO, Weapon X. Don't forget to let us know down in the comment section which two heads you want to see next. The most liked comment will be our next video. Hopefully if it's good, if it sucks, we'll think about it. Thanks for watching. I'll catch you guys next video. Till then kids. Oh, Get them dirty.